chilling out with Ryan Khalil, all pro center, at Ryan Khalil on Twitter, where he admits he's more of a looker than an actual tweeter here on the Rich Eisen Show. Who's the team to beat, you think, in the NFC? Who do you have to choose, Ryan? Um, Seattle. Uh, yeah, Seattle's a good team. They're the team to everybody's kind of chasing. You and you were there, obviously, on uh, divisional weekend last year. I was. How yes. often do you think of that game? At all? Not really. Yeah, a lot. I mean, yeah, it was a good football team. It's a hard place to play in. You're 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 you're, you're clamming up on me. I want bulletin board material. Come on, Ryan. What, what, do, you, what do you want? What do you want to know? Say you're going to kick their ass. What do you think? Uh, no, you're got, not going to go there. Year nine, it's not. Not my thing anymore. <laughs> Would you have done that in year one? Well, I took out a Super Bowl ad. I, I mean, I, That's true. yeah, don't you forget did about do that. that. But I've never said anything bad about anybody. I, I talk about how much I've You made up my t-shirts, team. didn't you? Did you make up t-shirts? No, the fans did. Okay. I have Ryan Khalil's back. And actually, funny thing is somebody tweeted me that they were at a uh, like a Goodwill in Florida and they <laughs> found <laughs> found that t-shirt. Yeah. It's pretty awesome. Why why'd you take out that Super Bowl ad? You just thought it'd be a good idea? No, I think what I, what was happening that season was is everybody was writing us off. We were only gonna win like two or three games. Right. And uh we had a lot of young guys on that team, and that was kind of bothering me that I think a lot of people were kind of reading into that and mm -hmm. buying into that. And, and that's just not the case in the NFL. I think teams are so evenly talented. Yes. It, I mean, anybody can win. That's why it's so popular. And so, I don't know. At that point, I was kind of mature enough to know that that's not the case. And instead of me saying it, I just kind of made, mm -hmm. a, made, a, made a more bigger splash was that message. Do you want to make up a, a, an ad right now? You and you you and I right now, we can make up an ad? Yeah, what, yeah what's it going to say? Okay, here we go. Are you going to pay for it? Is the Rich Eisen show going to pay for it this time? Do we have the budget laws? It was kind of expensive when I did It's in the budget. It. Yeah, we can definitely take out the Charlotte Observer. Is that what yeah, we're going for? Yeah, it's kind of expensive, yeah. Okay. okay. We'll Dear go, NFL. We'll go back page. Uh, I, I like am, the start of this. Dear team, NFL. Yeah, yeah. Uh, it's really I am good. Ryan Khalil. Okay. I just finished my fourth workout of the day. <laughs> I rose and grinded. <laughs> and I am coming to kick your ass this year. All 17 weeks, including the bye. What do you think? I love it. I'm, scrab I'm scribbling right now. No, I'm writing it. down only one uh, Shorthand. quarter of the words that I'm Shorthand. actually including the bye. Um, can't wait to see you all uh, in my rearview mirror as I party with Cam and the Vince Lombardi Trophy in the Niners Stadium. Uh, signed, Ryan Khalil? Sure. Or is there we, anything else? Sure. Okay. Are we taking this out together or this is just me? No, I just wrote it for you. Oh, you just wrote it oh, for no. me. Oh, no, and everyone, please go on the Rich Eisen Show. <laughs> there you go. There you go. They pay for the smack talking ads. Got it. Nicely uh, done. Signed, Ryan Khalil. Okay. Holmgren's on hold, huh? So I, should, I can write, a, I can write a, an ad for him, too, talking about how he's going <laughs> to he's gonna beat Herm Edwards in the, in the Southern Bowl, right? That's, that is correct. Okay. You send this off. I'm going to sign it off. Uh, Rhoda, would you we please take this over to yeah, Chris we'll Law? It. Call that into the Charlotte Observer. Will we will you do that for sure. Okay. Ryan There's Khalil. No you should call the too. Charlotte Observer right now and find out what it costs to take out a back page. Will ad. you please do that? <laughs> Donna, can you read what Does I wrote? It cost less than a room at the uh, British Open. At, at the St. British Andrews? Open at St. Andrews. In St. Andrews. That's the question. Ooh. Or, or, or Comic Con. You went to Comic Con. I right? did. I did. How many years in a row have you gone there? Since I was eight, I've been going. What? On and wow. Off. Yeah, since wow. I was eight. So what was huge, the best? Huge, huge fanboy. What was the best panel you saw down there? Star Wars, by far. Who was on that panel? Just all the old guys from from the Harrison uh, Ford, Harrison, Mark Hamill, Luke Skywalker. They were there. Really? They were there. Yeah. They had a big uh, concert, and it was pretty awesome. What, so they were no kidding. Yeah. Was R two D two there? I blend in or? really well. Big bearded guy with a Star Wars T shirt. It's they thought weird. you were a Wookie. Yeah, well, I just you know I don't stand out too much. In that <laughs> the crowd. Wookie hazing. Which as by a, the way, as by a the way, civilian, I, do you get to ask a question? Like if you wanted to ask Harrison Ford a question and you're in the audience, can you? Or is yeah, it media it's kind only? of a long line though. I just like to enjoy and hear what they're talking about, and pretty mm. excited for December. I'm not gonna lie. That's what it, Force Awakens. J.J. Uh, Abrams is yes. the director, and you yeah. know he knows what he's doing. I'm a big fan of J. Lawrence J. Kasdan 
is writing it. Yeah. And he, you know where he went to school, right? You know where he went to school? Did he go to, oh, did he go to Michigan? you bet he did. <laughs> did the big chill. He spoke at my graduation. He was the huge, commencement. Huge, huge Gaston fan. Yeah? Huge so fan. you got the right people in the mix here. Yeah. You're looking forward to that, huh? I am. And, by the way, I heard yes. you guys make dreams come true. Yes, we do. We're dream weavers. What do you need? Um, other than just the ad that we're putting in the Charlotte. Yeah, for you. yeah, other than that. Yeah, uh, yeah. Well, I thought that was just like a, I thought that was a, a free mutual theep? thing that yeah. you were, that you, yeah, yeah, sure, yeah. But so what, what, what can I do Does for you? Does that count or? as my dream? No, 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 oh, no, no. Okay, okay, oh, good. You, you have one more dream, sir. What, what's your dream? <laughs> okay, good. Do do I would love, and, and let me preface this by saying I have yes. no ambitions of being an actor okay. when I'm done playing football. What do you need? I would love yes. to be an extra, mm -hmm. some kind of like, uh, I don't know, Bounty Hunter or something uh -huh. in the new Han Solo movie coming out. Huge fan of Chris Miller and Phil Lord. Who oh, are, gosh. Who are, they've been they've on this the program. They've done the show. Those guys. Yeah. Absolutely love those guys. Huge fan of So them. now what they're exactly? Doing, what exactly? They, they, Disney announced, Lucasfilm announced that they're going to do the Han Solo like origin film. And you want to be an extra in that. So badly. Let's do this a little bit. Let's get you a speaking part. Get your SAG well, card. I, do you have gonna, your SAG card? I don't. I'm not going to. Okay. I don't want to reach. I don't, just to okay. be on set and maybe steal something for my own basement. Done. Another dream will be made to happen here on the Rich Eisen are Show. Are you promising this or are you saying we're going to inquire about it? I can inquire about it. No, I, I, I can't imagine that they would say they're, they're football fans. They are huge football fans. Yeah. Yeah. I, we'll I, make mean, this I would happen. absolutely love that. I mean, I don't know. I don't play for the Seahawks, which I think one of them. Is a Seahawks and if, fan, and if not that, with that beard, you can be on the Last Man on Earth. But I know Pete Carroll. I love that show. That's a isn't that a great <laughs> show? Great show. Oh, it is. Isn't that a great show? You got a little a Will Forte look about you. Hey, Thank I've you. got to take a break because Mike Holmgren's sitting there on the phone. I got it. More, uh, important, it, more important guest. Don't be ridiculous. I understand. I understand. We've enjoyed this uh, this chat with Ryan Khalil. Good luck to you, man. Thanks, buddy. Thanks for spending it. the last uh, moments of freedom with us Always. here. The Rich Eisen Show, weekdays at noon Eastern on audience.